Hey what's up guys, Z here, and in this video I'll be reviewing the B3300s. So these B3300s look exactly like Apple AirPods, except for the fact that these B3300s are Bluetooth. Now let's take a close up look at them. We have the right and left earpod that look exactly like the Apple AirPods, except for the fact that they're not Apple AirPods. And here's a side by side comparison. So the wire on the B3300s is flat. It's almost completely flat with a clip in the middle there that you can actually move up and down. So now the point of the clip would be to secure the ear pods to your shirt in case they actually fell out of your ears, which they definitely will fall out of your ears. I did find that true for me and I don't expect to actually be able to run with these ear pods in my ears. Now the quality on these B3300s are actually okay. They're not better than the Apple earpods, but they're definitely okay considering the price of $5.50. Now again, I did purchase these off AliExpress and I will have a link to that in the description below if you guys were interested in purchasing them. So now taking a look at the control board on these earpods, we do have the plus and minus for raising and lowering the volume. Plus we do have the middle button, which picks up and ends calls and does the same thing with the music. It pauses your music and it continues to play the music. Now under that, under the little tune there, we do have the microphone, the little microphone. And on the right of that, we do have a micro USB charging port. Now in order to turn on these Bluetooth earphones, you would basically hold the middle button there for three seconds and you would have a red and blue flashing light. And that would basically mean that it is ready to pair up. So now once it's ready to pair up, you would basically go into the settings of your iPhone or Android device, go into your Bluetooth settings and connect it to the B3300 that you see there. If you were wondering if these AirPods work with Android devices, I have not tested that out yet, but it does say on the AliExpress seller site that it does work with Android devices or at least Samsung devices. So now these AirPods don't come with any fancy packaging. It's pretty much a plastic Ziploc bag with a manual, instruction manual, and a USB charging cable. But honestly, for $5.50, I wouldn't expect them to pack this thing up in a cardboard box with some fancy cushions in there. So again, the sound quality on these earpods are not the greatest. I would say they're in between a pair of Apple earpods and between some Skull Candy earpods. They don't sound the best, they do sound okay, and again, they're okay for $5.50. So I'm going to sound sample them for about 30 seconds with different songs just to give you try to give you guys an idea and hopefully you'll get the idea of what they do sound like. So unfortunately I can't capture the exact sound, but they definitely do sound better than what you just heard there. So that's pretty much it guys. I mean, I wouldn't recommend this as your daily driver pair of earphones, but if you needed a backup junk pair, or maybe just like a gift for your kid or something like that, it's always good to have a backup junk pair. So I will have these linked in the description below if you guys were interested in purchasing them. Otherwise, that is going to be it. Hey, and if you guys want to see me review more products like this in the future, then definitely hit that thumbs up button so that I know. Otherwise, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys on the flip side.